Well, hi there again, guys and gals. This is my little stroke wish glider, which had a quite a balance problem. I think I may have sorted it, but the question is, did it survive this? Oh, this is little glider number two. The first one I built was pretty heavy. This was intended to be my lightweight one, and it is much lighter. Now, last time I flew this, it was uncontrollable. It just kept climbing vertically, and even with a lot of down elevator, I couldn't get it to fly properly. Quarter throttle, anything above quarter throttle, it was just flying vertically. I think it was down to the COG being wrong, too far back. So I've moved it a bit forward, and we give it another go. Not very nice up here today, grey and misty, but not a lot of wind. So let's give it a go. Oh, that's better. That's half throttle. Still climbing quite a lot. In fact, it's still climbing a lot. Right, that's... You see that tendency to climb and climb? I'm having to push the nose right down to get it to fly at all. Now that is... Actually that is... quarter throttle. It still doesn't want to fly. It is still climbing just crazy vertical with anything more than quarter power. I had real trouble actually then getting it to actually come back anywhere near me. I thought I was going to lose it. I nearly lost it last time here. But the good thing about this is you get soft landings on all this stuff. Right, don't go away. Right, well here we are up at the field. Still trying to sort out why this is climbing so much. I've moved the tail weight forward a little bit here and given it a little bit more down thrust. So hopefully it won't start climbing like crazy now when you put some power on. So let's see what happens. <coughs> Fuck me. That was no bloody good. <clears throat> oh. That's better. Still better at half throttle. Oh, that's better. It's not climbing like crazy now when it's um, full throttle. Much better. I think I've got it sorted. Oh, bah, bounce. Oh, bah. oh, that wasn't very good. I bloody lost it there, man. No, it looks a bit bent. Yep. Well, that's a shame. I lost the plot with it there, but look at that. It still survived. Oh well, the joy of a lightweight model. That was nose in crash, and look, no damage whatsoever to the front of the plane. All I've done is snap the tail because the carbon finished there. So five minutes with hot glue, and that'll be back in the air again. But at least I have sorted out the COG problem and the down thrust problem. But the other thing I've learned is the rates are way too high. So I need to adjust that because that first flight at full power, wow, it was responsive. 
as you saw I lost control but I think I've got this sorted now can't be bad at all for eight pounds